Hi everyone, this is your professor on Achievers Masterclass and today I want to be talking about a particular sign that is very interesting for us to know. Okay, now this sign is very important and I want you to pay attention. But before I go into it, if this is your first time of visiting my channel, thank you so much for coming. Thank you so much for passing by and please do me a favor by subscribing to my channel so that you'll be getting this juicy stuff and also clicking on the notification button so that whenever I post awesome and interesting videos like this you will be the first to be notified now if you are not new on this channel if you are one of my oldest I want to say thank you because you are the motivation like I always say that I need when it comes to posting videos when I want to, when I want to when I feel you know I don't feel like posting but when I see and I remember you people that are always there to you know pass by anytime i post it gives me motivation to keep on posting videos like this thank you so much for following me thank you so much for being a subscriber on this channel i really appreciate your support and effort thank you so much but do me a favor share this video to your social media community so that whenever you know i post videos like they'll be happy to see because i believe that there are lots of people that are in need of these juicy things that i post you understand but the problem is that they are not they don't have access to but you can do us a favor by sharing it to your social media community that they'll be very very glad that they are able to come in contact with such wonderful videos that will help them improve in their knowledge of driving thank you so much so right now let us go into this particular sign as quickly as possible all right follow me let's go Alright guys, now I want to quickly talk about these multiple signals that I found on this road. Now, the first arrow, if you look at the signs, there are about three of them. The first arrow with, that has the blue background and the white arrow that is pointing rightward is trying to let you know that where you are about to enter, any place you find such a signal, any place you find that long arrow, long white arrow, on that sign that, that has a blue background it's letting you know that the road wherever wherever it is posted is a one-way road they call it senso unico in italian in italy in italian language yeah they call it senso unico which is a one-way road trying to let you know that once you enter the road where this arrow is posted there are no vehicles that are coming on the other direction or they are coming on the opposite direction all vehicles are going towards the direction where the arrow is pointed okay so that is it about this signal very very simple to understand and you are not allowed to make a u-turn on such a road as well wherever you find this signal now the second one i believe you have an understanding it's very simple to understand whenever you see just know that it is on the sensor unico road or it is on the one-way road thereby you are not allowed to you know um do else do other, otherwise okay now the second one is i think i've explained this one is uh, in one of my subsequent videos in one of my previous videos the second one that has a red background oval shape with a red background and a white blocked line on it a white block line on it is trying to tell you that you are not allowed to enter the road where it is posted you're not allowed to enter you can come out from the road but you are not allowed to enter the road okay that's what the second one is telling you now the third one is a no park sign no park sign and if you look at it closely you see that there are reasons why it is a no park sign and why you're not allowed to park a no park sign is a place where it's post is a sign that tells you that you're not allowed to park mount in this case is trying to tell you that from 12 o'clock midnight to 8 o'clock in the morning you are not allowed to park why is it so and there are days first saturday of the moon they say first sabato primo sabato del means which means first saturday of the moon first saturday of the moon you're not allowed to park on this road from 12 midnight to 8 o'clock in the morning because the vehicle that cleans up that road is always at work at that particular time so you're not allowed to park they're also letting you know there's a signal they're letting you know that if you eventually park on this day and on these hours your vehicle will be towed your vehicle will be towed 
okay they will tow your vehicle so the signs are there the signals are there telling you that they will tow your vehicle if you park on that particular day and on that particular timing all right so with these signs i think i've been able to explain but if you need more clarity on these signals please let me see your comments in the comment section and as always i'll be available to give you the answers you desire if you also did lectures on how to scale through the driving theory exams let me see you your comments in the comment section and i'll get back to you okay so these signs are very very easy to understand once you follow this explanation you will be glad you did it will be easy for you to understand and i want you to also watch other videos that i have posted in the past so that you will get understandings of you know what this signals is talking about all right the white arrow tells you that you're about to enter a one-way road the red you know background sign is telling you that you cannot penetrate that road you cannot enter that road where you can come out you can come out from that road you can only come out you cannot drive into that road the third one is a no park sign at a particular day and at a particular at some particular hours okay see you thank you so much for listening thank you so much for paying attention and as always don't forget to subscribe if you have not done so already and for those that have subscribed please share this video so that other people will be able to have access to that which you are having access to thank you so much please don't fail to like this video and also don't fail to place your comment you need explanation thorough explanation about this science please let's see your comment you also need um private lectures or even online lecture you want to join our online class for lectures please let me see your comment in the comment section so that i can respond as quickly as possible we'll see how best we can assist you for you to be successful in your next driving theory exams all right thank you so much for your time stay blessed all right guys i believe you've been able to understand you know the video the diagram we posted on the video thank you so much for following us so please if you have any questions so far about the explanations i've just made let me see your comments in the comment section put your questions in the comment section and as usual i'll be there to give you the answers the correct answers though that you so desire now if you've not subscribed like i said before do us a favor subscribe share this video to your social media community so that they can be you know beneficial this video will be beneficial to them so share it to them let them have one or two things to learn and also if you are interested in our lectures if you are interested in joining our online class and our offline class with other candidates you want to join them because you want to be successful in your driving theory exam please contact us by leaving a comment in the comment section and i'll put you through on the next thing to do thank you so much for your time and until when we meet again have a wonderful day thank you so much and bye bye